Unbelievable. Truly unbelievable. You will be shocked why Southeast governors chickened out of Southern governors meeting. All revealed. All revealed. Remember that Enugu State Governor was the person who hosted this meeting. And I love the way they are doing it, you see. The first meeting was held in the South-South. Then it went to the Southwest. And the one that was held last week, Thursday, was at the Southeast. What should have been the right thing? All Southeast governors there to play host to the other uh, Southern governors. But what did they do? None of them came. Starting from your very own brother, Hope. He has never even attended any of the meeting, showing solidarity with President Muhammad Buhari rather than his people. Remember, he was never voted for the deceit of the century. And so he has to show to the world that um, he, you know, he has to show to, to Buhari, to those who brought him into office, that I am loyal. I don't care whatever these people are doing. After all, he's not really a governor anyway. So you don't expect much from him. Uh -huh. So you should not be disappointed that he did not attend. But the others, David, the others, uh, what's their names now? It's a shame, honestly speaking. If you're from the southeast, I want to tell you that your governors did not do well. Okay, they didn't do well. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like or share, subscribe. Let's get all the details. Thank you. Last Thursday, governors of the southeast stunned their colleagues from the south when they failed to attend a meeting of the 17 Southern governors hosted by Enugu State Governor, Ifine. It was not an emergency meeting. The meeting was fixed during the previous one held in Lagos. On July the 5th, 2021, there was also a reminder that was circulated among the governors about the meeting and its venue. That could amount to the preparation and efforts put into it by the host state to ensure there was no itches. The government house Enugu venue of the gathering wore a new and fresh look with reconstruction, artwork, designs and decorations that were ready to display to give the ghost the host and the, to display by the host to give the guests an evergreen memory of Enugu, the East. The entertainment were also not left out. No one doubted the readiness of the governor and put the events that put the event together. Except for the host, the Enugu state governor, the governor of Imu, Hope, that of Abia, that of Abia, Ikbaze, Eboi, David Umai, we are represented by their deputy, why Anambra Governor Willie neither attended nor sent a representative. What a shame. However, there was a meeting. The governors of the zone went, were expected to attend fully. It should have been the Enugu meeting that is just around the corner, being hosted by them from the zone. The fact that they were that they would have to travel short distance to the, to the place where this meeting was being held and did not even come around to show support to their colleague in the Southeast was a big shame. Again, except for Hope, they were all present during their first meeting held on May 11, 2021 in Asaba, Delta State, where they resolved to bound open grazing in the Southern region as well as the need for consigned effort in tracking worsening security in the country. As soon as they concluded the Enugu meeting, which was the third in the year, various interpretations has developed as to why the absence of the governors and why some have said it was a betrayer. On the part of the governors of the Southeast region, others have insisted that it was part of their politics who gets what in 2023, which is they are against one another. And this is why what is happening in the South is, is happening. They are not together. They are not one. Everybody wants something. David Umayi wants to be vice president or president. 
hope i hope it's not ready yet uh, but you know that he was not elected so he had to show solidarity to those who put him in office you see so let's continue he said the betrayer on the part of the governors of the southeast region others have insisted that it was part of their politics of who gets what in 2023 there are feeling that the politics of in individualism being practiced by the governors of the region was responsible for why things are the way they are in the southeast it is hard to remember the last time the current governor collectively pulled any successful efforts since they are coming on board to track the challenges of the zone their resolution had always ended in a wide dream they've never really come together there are others who feel that certain criterias and issues has emerged from previous meetings since they started that have tendency to challenge the politics and powers of President Muhammad Buhari and the federal government may have contributed to the logistics and why these governors have chickened out. The governors of the South is proof to Nigeria that they want to worship or they are worshipping Muhammad Buhari and secretly those who have not joined APC will eventually because of what they want. One of the issues reportedly unsettling the governors and the federal government is the bound on the open grazing, which they are very unsure of. Reacting to the Asaba meeting, it was gathered that the decision could have been possible if there was no meeting of the governors. The decision would have unsettled the president and lead to open hostility. And this is what the governors of the South is you know do not want that confrontation with president muhammad buhari it's sad people but the the governors of the south is yes uh rather um they would rather stay with buhari they would rather play it safe they would rather go against their people rather than what is right standing and being doing right by their people it's really a shame if you consider all that is happening a big one at that okay a very big shame because all that is happening proved to us that if this country is to move forward, some of these people call leaders are not leaders. I'm not saying Wike Le uh, is a golden child, but if you look at Wike, he knows what he he knows what he's standing for. He knows what he's saying, and he's not even you know he's not he's not even missing words around it. He's not he's not a plain hacking panky game with anybody. He says it as it is. Sadly, the governors of the South is are rather chickens. Leave us a comment. We'd love to hear from you. God bless you. Have a lovely day. Bye for now. Bye.